good morning you guys so today is saturday i don't know i have a little bit to fill you guys in on okay first off i'm still doing my internship well you guys already know that well now you do um so yeah i'm still doing my internship um just working monday through friday kind of figure trying to figure out what <laughs> i'm doing with my life um Meaning, I'm in limbo right now, like, I'm in between, I don't know if they're going to hire me on permanently, and going back to my old job. So, it's like, my internship ends on the 10th of August. I'm supposed to report back to school on the 31st of July. But I also have a vacation that I'm taking. I don't know what I'm gonna do about that. I'm just trying to pray about it and then I'm just gonna have to wait it. Let me turn off my nightlight. But I'm just gonna have to wait it out. I have to have some kind of faith in God and just let the whole thing blow over and put it in his hands and pray about it. But on to another note, um, today I am supposed to be going to, no, I'm going to a mean greet. I'm just gonna insert a picture right here. She is the ultimate girl boss. Um, she is a celebrity stylist. I went to high school with her sister, but I th that's neither here nor there. Like, I didn't know, you know what I'm saying? And I like, have so many questions, but I know this is not like a panel. This is just a meet and greet, but I like have so many questions in my mind. Like, I'm not even gonna bore you guys with that. But the ultimate challenge for me today is going to be vlogging because I really want to vlog it but I know I'm going to this event by myself and I know when I pull out my camera and start vlogging I'm probably gonna get like just a teeny bit nervous because one people are always watching me already but if I have a camera in my hand and you know what I'm saying and I'm like hey no, I'm not used to that so I'm kind of like in this thing where I'm trying to break out my shell and be more comfortable not with just you guys because I already talked to you guys at home but I'm trying to be more comfortable with me um, and I need to figure out what I'm gonna wear today because it says it's gonna be cloudy as well as rainy but I mean the Sun is clearly out this is the natural light that's coming to me right now so we'll see oh yeah you guys so I've been a little down lately I mean, I don't know if it's just life situations or what's going on because I'm in a, in a really crazy transition right now and I feel it, but I can't explain it thoroughly to you guys until I'm actually going like completely through it. But I know I'm changing and like the friends around me are changing. I have been down because of that and work and a whole situation, but I'm, I'm bouncing back. I needed a new feng shui in my um, living room area. So I did a couple of things differently. I'm gonna show you guys right quick, really, really quick. This living room piece right here, I just got this. Um, somebody threw it out. This is actually a lamp and I just revamped it. It used to be like a potted flower that I bought from TJ Maxx and I just took the flowers out and weaved it through the bamboo lamp and I came out with this. I just moved this from over there. I didn't like it anymore. And I put it over here and I'm trying to figure out things to do with it. Like, I don't, I don't know. I want something else there. So I'll figure that out in a little bit. Um, couch is still where it's been. It's always been. Um, I just, yeah, I flipped those around the other way. This is what I put my feet up on because sometimes one couch is not enough. And I put my, um, this right here used to be at the door. My stuff inside the ottoman, like my sewing machine is in there. I made room and I just like rearranged stuff. What's new here is actually this box. This box, I was gonna throw it out, but it's an Estee Lauder box and it was like, it's the real leather and I didn't want to throw it away. And I was like, what can I really do with this? So, because I really have a lot of red hints, that's red, that's red, and then like orange and all of that ties in red, red. So I just put it over here so I can tie it in with the red thing that's going on in here. And it worked out really well because all my camera lenses are in there. 
and I really needed somewhere to put them so I ended up putting them in there. I went ahead and I made this, I, it used to be like a flower pot that was right here and I had it ever since college. I used to have a fake candle in there and I put them around a real candle in here and I lit it up and it's really really pretty and relaxing at night and I'm gonna go ahead and start getting ready for my day because I definitely definitely need to make a um put a screw right here so I can hang my bag when I come in the house. Oh yeah, and I forgot to tell you guys. So this shoe rack used to be right there. And I figured when I come in the house, I really just want to stop right here and make this area my shoe area. You know, just kick off my shoes. Cause I have a lot of dirt when I track. When I come in, it tracks from right here. And I used to have my shoe rack right here and I used to have like a whole bunch of dirt. So I figured why not just put this right here so I just kick my shoes off automatically after I wipe them off at the door and just leave the dirt track right here so I'll just sweep it out and the rest of the dirt won't track over here because I used to have like a whole bunch of dirt in my um, kitchen area. Alright so. you guys, so I did my makeup. I must say it looks really, really good today. I guess it's because I took my time and I did everything that I felt Excuse me, I just say, but I did everything that I felt my face would need to make it, you know, pop, and I love the results. So I think I'm gonna stick to this for right now. Um, yeah, but anyways, I'm having like so much anxiety right now, you guys. Like anxiety is real. Like it's so heightened right now. But anyway, <sighs> inhale the roses, blow out the candle. Inhale the roses, blow out the candles. I'm so trying to tell myself to chill the F out right now. But anyways, I'm trying to get my outfit together. And I tell you guys, I changed like one, two, three times. I, I went over my outfit like last night, then today, and so on and so forth. So, oh, excuse me. I just ate, okay. I just came up with this. Um... I was iffy about the heel I am gonna wear the wedge but I was iffy about it because for some reason like the back of my ankle has been hurting I heard it some kind of way at work I don't know how um so yeah I'm just gonna end up wearing this top that I have well that I made and these pants from Old Navy and these wedges that I got from the thrift store from Goodwill I originally had on those white pants over there. I know they look a mess. But I yeah, I had on those white pants and it didn't come up high enough to my liking. And like I still have this pouch that I'm trying to get rid of, so I was like, nah, I'm not gonna I don't wanna be uncomfortable and pull all evening. So I'm just gonna go ahead and wear these pants. And yeah. Heidi, it's real. I keep saying that because it's so real right now. I'm going to this event by myself and I hope I get enough footage and I vlog enough because you know I'm nervous I'm really nervous so if I don't whip out the camera it'll probably be on snapchat if it's not on snapchat or insta just know I tried to come out of my shell yeah so I'll see you guys there I guess yeah Let's talk about the event. Oh, let me put us down. 
Anyway. <laughs> okay. The event, you guys. I it was it was a very intriguing event. And I didn't realize how fortunate or how lucky I was just to be in that room of a female entrepreneurs. Like it was just such a cool feeling to be in a room full of women who experience the same things I've experienced and have word, nothing but words of encouragement. I was very fortunate because of the fact that y'all she posted her social on her social media, her IG, and she just said uh make a comment and i'm just gonna dm you guys the um the area or you know wherever of the meetup and i didn't think you know she's gonna dm me but i was like you know what i'm saying she dm me she dm me she don't oh well you know life goes on but you know she dm me the address and i'm very fortunate to meet her like i'm doing something right i don't know what i'm doing but i'm doing something right I'm not just saying like oh you know i'm better but it's just like that puts you in certain predicaments and certain situations for certain reasons. So I've, I've got to be doing something right. I don't know what I'm doing, but I've got to be doing something right, right? So yeah, today's my aunt's birthday. So I'm gonna go ahead and get off this. I'm gonna get my life together, retouch my makeup because eight o'clock will be here before you know it and somebody will be knocking on my door. So I'm just gonna recharge and do what I need to do and I will check you guys a little bit later. Bye. Come on. <laughs> what an We rushing back to the car. Why did not pee when we were at the Guess who got it? <laughs> Why did not pee when I was at the <laughs> Alright you guys, what's up? So excuse me if you can't hear this. I'm just at home. I got back in. I think it's at it's a pretty reasonable hour. I believe it's 32. It's not too reasonable, but it's a pretty reasonable hour. Um yeah, so as you guys seen, or I went to Sky Lounge and they were all right. I'm, I'm about to take off my makeup, by the way, so I'm just gonna chit chat with you guys about my whole day, my whole entire day. Lila. I can't talk. Um, so yeah, and excuse me, I am missing my little press on nails. I can't wear acrylics because I'm allergic, but that's another story. But yeah, so we ended up going to Sky Lounge. And from there, my homegirl Alex wanted to go to Bungalow, but we're gonna go to church tomorrow. And I need to bring a change of clothes because I know from there I gotta pick up my nephew and go to my grandma's house and um, go to a birthday party at McDonald later on. So today was pretty, pretty adventurous for me because on the weekends that I don't vlog, that's the weekends I'm like in the house not doing shit kind of like you know get my life together i guess i could put out more content but i know that i want to get like a better sd card and a better camera so i want to put out really good content on what i'm doing and today um, at that event it really inspired me to be like i need to keep going because like sometimes i do get discouraged because it's like I'm really not getting any views off of these videos, but at the end of the day, I specifically have to remind myself, my story has to be told some kind of way, even though it's not like a, it, you know, a, it's, it's just a boss up journey. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm coming from nowhere, going somewhere. And I'm struggling at, at times, you know, I do get tired, but I do have to remind myself that I need to keep going started this journey a long time ago I'm here for a reason and I need to fulfill like everything so I'm about to go ahead and just um get in the bed oh yeah I wanted to show you guys so my friend Melanie gave me this book it is called own your glow a guide to uh, luminous living and crowning the queen within so this I want to read this and I'm gonna tell you guys about it um Oh, this is interesting this is cute let me just talk to you guys later because i'm about to start reading i'm not even gonna lie to you for like an hour at least so i'll catch you guys tomorrow morning or tomorrow evening whichever hey guys Bye. happy sunday so i am at church right now and i'm about to go in it's 11 35 i know we're super late but i'm just waiting on my friend mel she just parked and then we're gonna go ahead and head in the church and get this word and then i gotta go on about my day all right you guys Ooh. 
I just picked up the Jaden, and we are on our way to yeah, Linda's birthday party. You ready to go play? Are you ready to go play? Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready to go play? Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, um, we're on our way there, and I guess I will talk to you guys when we get there. Hopefully this will be. Back at the house now. Say hello, Jada, because I know you want to talk. Hello, guys. In today we are blowing bubbles. He is blowing bubbles. We got back from the picnic or the um, outdoor birthday party. It's about to rain in a little bit. Really heavy. So I'm eating a bologna sandwich. I was supposed to cook tonight. I know I'm being really, really lazy, but I'm tired. I went to church, yeah. went to this party, then went grocery shopping. And the most horrible thing happened, like, so I'm checking out, uh, don't interrupt, don't do that. I'm checking out at the register. My sister sends me money. I sent the money to the wrong account. So I'm holding up the line. I have to take things off. And then I figured out what was wrong right then and there in the line. So it was just really embarrassing. But I had to put some money around or I had to take some things off as well. So, oh man. This is it. I think we're in for the night. Oh, I felt a raindrop. I, I felt one too. Maybe I was sick. So this is it for this weekend vlog, you guys. I guess I'm gonna go ahead and close it out and I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Bye. Bye, y'all.